here today we are heading back, 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 back to the Imperial Castle. Take a look at this. Wabbity, 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 wabbity. Just to give you guys an idea of the size of this hall. Yo, what's going on, people? Century Mad Collector here, back again with another video. It is Friday, August 4th, and we are just one week removed from Toys for the Ages, and I am already missing my time down in Carlisle, Pennsylvania. Andy, the creator of Toys for the Ages, just recently announced officially that Toys for the Ages will be back in the summer of 2024. I cannot wait. I'm already counting down the days. If you haven't already, go check out my Toys for the Ages video. It is the most recent upload here on the channel. But today, here today, we are heading back, 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 back to the Imperial Castle in Pauling, New York. John has set aside, so graciously set aside a few items for me. It's been a couple of months since I've been there. So I'm super excited to see him, to pick up these items, and to check out what the store has to offer for us here on this Friday. So happy Friday to you all. I have no idea when this video will come out, but happy Friday to you all, always and forever. And I will see you at the Imperial Castle. You're in my favorite nook of the store, right when you come in, right as you walk in off to the right. LJN, AD&D, Warduke, Paralay, Zarak, Kellick and Strongheart in the back, Fire Elemental, some of the PVCs. Pretty amazing. All in really nice condition too. Some Battle Beasts, a few of them with the weapons. Bucky and Swamp Thing back there, and some Robo Force looking pretty minty if I do say so myself. Jumping around a bit, I'm in the back of the store now, random case. These Mighty Crusaders are so nice. We saw them carded, a couple of them carded at Torch for the Ages, but I didn't pick any up. Oh wow, is that Psydot laying down, dead there? Power Lords? I think it is. Wait, what? Quick shot of the close enough. loose bagged Motu mix of Motu and TMNT. So last time you were here, did you get oh. anything for free from us for your birthday? A complete movie three we dawn. We started a little tradition. I you think might I'm have to take that. So. First table. Take a look at this. We have a Starriers sighting here. The armored battle station. Little dirty, missing some decals. I bet my buddy Chad Plouffe could clean this thing right up, make it look like a million bucks. If this was in better shape, I would I would absolutely add this to my pile. And check all of this other Starrier stuff. Gouge, looking very mint and complete. And I think this whole lot is pretty complete and take a look and see exactly what's complete and what's not john has obviously gone through this already so we can absolutely trust what's labeled here is good oh man i i think some of these home. Damn it. I was not planning on spending money on this stuff. Oh boy. But how often are you going to come across a lot of Starriers complete and in nice condition? The answer is not often. So we've moved a bit deeper into the dungeon here. I just want to show you guys a closer look while being knee deep in this stuff as to how much is down here.
Vintage Joe's being sorted and prepped for the big time. Big old mess of them. Random dungeon find alert as we make our way through here. We came across some random willow figures, Tonka Willow. If you guys are following along on the channel, you know that I have a bunch of these carded. I'm looking for the Ebersisk. Awesome to see this. And we are deep into the dungeon now. Looking at a very nice Point Dread and Talon Fighter here. Wow. Gray skull behind it. And down here, some Lucy's I don't remember seeing, at least not the last time I was here. Got a blade back there. Take a look at this table. Come get your everything. Battle Cat, Rodon, Stridor. Wow. Ooh, and you got a Battle Bones back here? I know John has one upstairs, sealed, but... Wow, wait a second. <laughs> wait a second. He didn't tell me about this. More loose Motu. Mechanic. Triclops. These are already an Imperial. Official Imperial Castle. Whiplash. Imperial Castle. Collector cases. Modulook. Collector case. Wow, there's all sorts of stuff down here, huh? What else do we got? Stratos. Ooh. Ooh, this Grizzlor. Oh, baby. Thank you very much. Gonna put that right there. Money. What else do we have? What other money am I going to be spending here? Jeez. Cyclone. Roboto. Clover Khan. Got one of these reserved. This one looks good. The Whiplash. Too bad down here. We can take him out. Legs are very loose. Wobbity, 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 wobbity. A very nice looking space station here. Check this out. Really nice. Stickers are nice. I'm not proud of this. I'm not ashamed of that, but a little bit. No, this was all like one big collection, so I've been just taking it apart. So like the turtles. I'm Lord there. Vader there. So I did all the turtles, then I did all the uh, I did all the Star Trek you wanted them. Are you aware of I will have to inquire about Sweet how much shit. this is. This yeah, is yeah, one of my favorite oh, absolute favorite I think like the detective or someone vintage kind of Star Wars play sets. Like, hey folks, it is the very next day, Saturday, August fifth. Just got done cleaning the garage with the wife. And I laid out the entire hall here on my dining room table so I could share it with you. I can't wait to have this toy room so I don't have to share monster halls with you in a spare bedroom or in my dining room. But nonetheless, we have the entire mega hall here from the Imperial Castle. So why don't I flip the camera around and show you guys what I got. All laid out here on my dining room table just to give you guys an idea of the size of this hall. I can't wait to have my toy room so I don't have to do this in my dining room. But anyway, from left to right, why don't we begin? Some of the Sektar bugs in very nice condition. Star Ears, Deadeye and Cricket, only missing one disc in really nice condition. Antenna's intact. And we have some other Star Ears. Hot Shot, Claw Gut, Gouge, Crank, 
We also have a Pegasus here, Clash of the Titans, a real beauty. That is the piece initially that John had set aside for me months ago. And then the rest of this <laughs> was just tacked on yesterday. Cut up some of the little guys. Some more sectars in excellent condition with their bugs. Some of the wings there. And then as we pan up a bit, some carded Motu. That is the Grizzlor that we found in the dungeon. One of the dungeon finds from our latest trip here on this hunt. Another dungeon find here, Battle Bones. And some other carded Motu that John had set aside for me as well. Snake Face, Too Bad, and Rio. And that, folks, is the haul. I probably should not forget. Movie three, pretty minty and complete. Samurai Don. Now we're done. Okie dokie, folks. That's going to wrap it up for this one. I hope you all enjoyed it. Let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of the haul here today, as well as my latest trip to the Imperial Castle. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.